nebulous. Ne, ne, nebu, bu. It's like, be like cute. It's that u, u, nebulous. So not lows, but us, lus. Nebulous. This means unclear, vague, or hazy, lacking definite form or boundaries. The example, the concept of happiness can be quite nebulous as it means different things to different people. I cannot agree with this more. I was literally debating <laughs> the, the merits of happiness and how we overuse the word happy in, in modern society in a way that I think is detrimental to, to mental health. So see, conversations like those, and I know a lot of you love, you have a lot of deep thought, and whether it's about the concept of happiness or if it's about the Super Bowl game, <laughs> whatever conversations you're having, uh, having the option of using C2 level vocabulary, it's like, it's like having new colors to paint with. You can paint beautiful pictures with the colors, with the English that you have, but having more, it gives you options. And some of you are, there are certain topics that you're really deep thinkers or you, you really want to share that next level of, of descriptiveness. So this can help. Let's try again. The concept of happiness can be quite nebulous as it means different things to different people. Good. And remember here, we've got some connected speech opportunities. Let's say we have concept of, so instead of concept of, concept of, it's very subtle, um, as it, so the S in at, it's, if you say ass, it's going to sound like A-S-S. So in this case, it actually sounds a little bit like a Z, as it, as it means. Now, different things to different people. Notice I don't over articulate the T, different. So the Americans, we do reduce that a lot, different, different. This is designed to help you really understand how to look, feel, and sound more confident, how to refine your American accent, and how to communicate in a way that is genuine to you. If all of this sounds like something that's interesting to you, welcome, and let's get started right now.